Christmas and all through the house, not a creature was stirring, not even a mouse. Then came Scrooge's call through the PM's headset. You owe me repayment of the national debt. But Scrooge, Christmas is for Santa and cute elves, candy canes and budgets that balance themselves. No, snaps Scrooge, Santa's in debtor's jail till you pay. I'll leave him there and ruin Christmas Day. I need cash in a flash, cried out JT, perhaps speaking fees for my friends at WE. The central bank will make our dollars double, reducing by half my money troubles. Doubling the number of each coin will make us more, turning loonies to toonies and toonies to four. Each party will chip in some coins for free. If it's loonies we need, they're in the NDP. <laughs> we'll host liberal fundraisers, social distance, no doubt. That's easy enough. Liberals are always spaced out. Meanwhile, at North Pole was a plan underway to set Santa free and save Christmas Day. Out of a helicopter, an Air Force vet ran, a dashing and handsome, slightly balding man. <laughs> Goodness, asked St. Nick, who's this man on a mission? My gosh, it's the leader of the opposition. The leader cut the bars and set Santa away, who wasted no time and ran straight for his sleigh. But as he jumped on, a reindeer did buck. Santa stubbed his big toe and yelled, oh, shucks. Then off, and the chariot went. Up it soared, our children's dreams renewed and also restored, proving again Christmas dreams can come true as Santa and all turn their colors to blue. Oh. <laughs> no comfort whatsoever that you are indemnified by the government of Canada. That means that the taxpayer has to pick up any losses you have. And Mr. Kelly's question was a good one. You're buying these bonds at inflated prices. The Honorable Member for Mount Royal. For a slightly less partisan Christmas poem. Tis the last seating week before Christmas for this virtual house. Instead of coming to Ottawa, MPs are home with their spouse. Using a new cloud platform, never leaving the room, house meetings or committee, it all happens on Zoom. Making speeches of brilliance, winning each dispute, only to realize that you are on mute. Working for your constituents, fighting for grants, wearing shirt, tie, and jacket with no need for pants. For MPs tackling a virus has become the most important of tasks. We beseeched all Canadians to wash their hands and wear masks. With the Team Canada approach, there is no I or me for Parliamentarians 2020 has been all about we. We've worked together on programs that have made all the news. Millions of Canadians have used CERB, SECRA and SUS. In this crazy environment, Division is something we cannot afford. Politicians must come together, like Freeland and Ford. Si Saint Nicolas envers nous sera plus ou moins sévère. Saint Nicholas could be severe with us or not, based on the various behaviors of the different parties, with their different colors. I fear that the only ones to really win his approval will be our pages. The opposition keeps asking for more information about this virus. But what we want from Christmas is that we finally get a vaccine. For something, it is clear what that would be. A return in 2021 to real normalcy. Thank you, Mr. Speaker.